Good morning, my YouTubers. I pray that you're all doing well. <coughs> um, I would have done this video a while ago, but I had no internet, no cable, no phone. Um, I was supposed to have a power outage, but I lucked out and got out of that. Thank goodness. But the reason for this video is... Um, I will be taking my channel a different direction. There will be no more Reborns featured on this channel. Um, this will be more of a lifestyle. Um, um, I do deal with a lot of health issues. Um, I share a lot about my faith um it's just more going to be about my lifestyle and you know things that i deal with um in my life and um right now i'm going through a lot and um some of it i can share and some of it i cannot share right now um but um tuesday i went to the doctor actually <clears throat> my doctor wants me to have a back brace but i didn't know what kind of a back brace he wanted me to have little did i know when i went tuesday to this appointment he wants me to have a full length corset back brace which is going to go all the way up to my chest and all the way down and it's gonna um, kind of like squeeze me and squeeze my back because I have osteopenia which is the step down before osteoporosis and he doesn't want anything to happen to my bones but I also have um, osteo uh, I have um, arthritis in my spine Plus, I have um, uh, posture issues where I have trouble sitting up straight. I don't know if it's because I don't remember to sit up straight. I've always had trouble sitting up straight. I have um, a disease in my spine called Sherman's disease. It is the opposite of scoliosis. You know how scoliosis curves your spine. and uh, You know how scoliosis curves your spine. Well, my spine curves the opposite way and leaves kind of like a hump in your back. And um, I have the hump. And they want to prevent that from getting any worse, too. So I'm going to have that brace to... Um, help prevent that and I will be getting that on the night and when I get it I will show it to you and I asked when I was there you know I <coughs> usually they come in white or black but you can ask for um, you know to have them decorated so I'm like, can I have mine decorated? And so mine's going to be decorated with butterflies. And I think it's pretty cool because if I'm going to have something and I have to wear it outside my clothes because you can't wear it next to your body. And I have to wear it outside my clothes. Um, I want it to look cute. And so, that's what I, and it's one that I can put on myself. The other one they were going to have me put on, I wasn't going to be able to put on myself. And I wasn't going to be able to wear it as much as I need to. I said, it has to be one I can put on myself without my caregiver. And so, um, they are going with the corset brace that, um, straps there's three straps on both sides 
um, if you look up medical corset and you see the um it's like a hard it's a hard brace that goes all the way up to your chest all the way down and it goes all the way up your spine and if you see that then you'll probably get the right one um i wish i could insert in their video but i don't know how to do that but i'll probably post it on my instagram for those of you who are in on my instagram because i did get a picture to show somebody what it looked like and um so i'll probably post it on my instagram and hopefully that will help my back to feel better because i've been dealing with a lot of back pain because of all this art you know the arthritis plus the colder weather although uh here lately the weather hasn't been too cold um we have gone through another wind spell and i <coughs> I was supposed to be in the affected area. I checked the night before. And I was supposed to be in the affected area to get the power shut off. Well, the night before, I prayed with somebody. And we prayed against my power being shut off. And the night before, I checked our electric company's website. And it said... I was supposed to be shut off. And then my power didn't get shut off when it said it was going to get shut off. And then about 8 o'clock that morning, I checked the power company again. And it says I, w I wasn't in the affected area anymore. And I'm like, thank you, Jesus. He heard my prayer. Um... The only thing that was effective was my cable, my cable TV, my internet, and phone. And it was effective for 24 hours. And I, I had two anxiety attacks. Because um, I had to have some form of sound. That's one thing I deal with is, you know, because of part of my medical stuff, I deal with anxiety. And... I had an anxiety attack in the morning before my caregiver came. And then after my caregiver left, probably about um, 5.30, 6 o'clock, somewhere around there, I had another anxiety attack. And then I just went in and went to bed. And um, I actually went to sleep about 7 a little bit after 7 o'clock. Um, and then I got up at 5 o'clock this morning. <laughs> and got some really good coffee. I got some uh, Kona coffee, which is Hawaiian coffee. <coughs> it's um, Hawaiian coffee. It was really good. Sorry, guys. I don't have my teeth in. But... Um, I just wanted to let you guys all know that, you know, I, I hope and pray that you'll all stick with me, that I will no longer be featuring um, Reborns on my channel. I wanted to show you, and I hope, actually, I'm going to flip the camera around. Well, I guess I can't flip it around while I'm video recording, so... Um, I made this hat for my very first caregiver for Christmas. Just finished it the, this morning. It's a beanie. Um, I made this hat right here for my daughter-in-law. I had a little help with my caregiver starting it, but once she started it, I um, finished it. And this one, because my son's got a bigger head and I know he likes the kind where you fold down, I just made it a little longer and I folded down the bill a little bit. And I want to make me one of these. I like that. 
And then the hat that I'm wearing, I also made that hat too. So, um, I love it. But I want one of those ones because it goes over the ears. Um, I've been having a lot of ear pain lately. Um, my right ear has been really hurting so bad. And um, we were going to go to the doctor on Friday, but my caregiver doesn't feel comfortable taking me in her car because there's a nail in her tire and she went yesterday because she got off early yesterday to um, go get that checked out and they said her tires are really bad. So um, she's got two appointments today and she's supposed to come in tomorrow. I'm praying she does. And then um, Friday, which is Friday, uh, we were going to take me to an, my, make a doctor's appointment and take me, but she doesn't feel comfortable. Hopefully they'll get tires on Saturday so I can make an appointment Monday or Tuesday because this ear here, every so often if I go like this, my ear gets is kind of like a little moisture in it and it hurts so, so bad. I've been having to, you know, like lay my heating pad on it. My left ear hurts too, but not as my not as bad as my right. And um, like if I cry, the pressure gets intense, and I hear a swish, swish, swish sound in my eyes. Like yesterday when I had that anxiety attack, and I just cried, and I all I could hear is swishing in my ear, like water heating up against uh, rocks or something and it was very painful so I I need to get in to see the doctor ASAP um, but I'm just holding my phone this way I'm hoping to get a tripod for Christmas because the tripod I have I'm afraid that putting my phone on it. It's not going to work. I mean, it's going to fall off, but I can still do it, which I'll probably do, you know, sit down on videos or even take my phone around the community and just, you know, talk about where, you know, because I live in a, my, my apartment complex is gorgeous. I won't show you my address or anything because I don't want people to know where I live. But I can show you, you know, about, you know, like my backgrounds. Um, because, I mean, my back patio is gorgeous. You see trees. I have a creek out there. It's just gorgeous. Um, I've been missing everybody. Been missing videos. Even though I won't be making Reborn videos anymore, I still will be watching Reborn videos. Because I know there will be people making Reborn videos. But I know a lot of people that were making Reborn videos won't be making Reborn videos anymore. I just feel more comfortable um, taking my videos over to Instagram TV. And doing it that way. Even though I like longer videos. That ain't going to happen. Unless I make them on Facebook. And I am in a group on Facebook that I can um, do that in. And I'll probably make videos over there too. And I don't know if I can say the name of the group. So I will leave that quiet for now. If it's okay to say the group, I will. But right now, I'm going to keep it quiet until I know if I can mention it. Um, I know that there are some people already from the YouTube community are over there. <coughs> but I don't know if I can mention it or not. So I won't. There's little honey. Honey, go. Look over here. Hey. 
Oh. Well, she's looking. Hey, this way. I'm going to turn the phone this way. Hey. Hey. I don't know if you guys can see her. There you are, hopefully. I'm going to have to rewatch this video back and see if <laughs> see if you guys got to see this little turkey. Yeah. She's been going at night like every maybe half hour to an hour she's been wanting on the bed. I don't know what her deal is. But she's a crazy little girl. Anyway, everybody, the direction of my channel is this will now be my lifestyle channel. Um, and my name fits it, Breeze Place. Um, I hope that you all will stick with me and just be a part of my family. Um... I thank you all for sticking around with me this long. I know I've lost several subscribers. And I just pray that you will um, continue to be with me. Remember to find joy in your journey no matter where you are. Whatever you're going through, there's always something to be joyful for and about. Remember to love yourselves and to love each other. Before you can love someone else, you've got to love yourself first. Love you all, and until another video, bye-bye.